I have something pretty neat to share with you guys. My brother released two games on Roblox. <laughs> now these games, they're nothing huge, all right? But they are fun. The first game is called Dropkick, which is kind of like a racing, bee hopping, ah! surf type game. And then he has Easy Dev, which is like a developer tycoon. I think this was his way of releasing his microtransgressions against game development in general. This one is also pretty cool. And we'll be playing both of these games today at some point. But Dropkick is the main focus. Why? Because Dropkick is just a ton of fun. And also, it might have something to do with the fact that my kid brother, who happens to be 40 minutes older than me, said, you can make a map for my game. This is great news. And you know what? I might make a map so bad that it ruins his game forever. Welcome to the wonderful world of Dropkick. You can only do two things in this game. One, Dropkick. Two, jump. And then drop kick, and then jump, and then drop, and then you just go. <laughs> you can also slide into people and ragdoll them. They have to not be sliding when you do it. Ah! Ah! Why is this guy screaming? Yeah, my way. Hit the ramp. Jump over the wall. <laughs> if you guys haven't noticed, I'm kind of a master of this game. First place. See at the bottom, losers. Losers, get out of my way. Come on. Oh no, I lost momentum. No, no. <laughs> and that's why you don't want to stop sliding. Oh. When you get it though, when you get going, hey, come on, no, 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 no. So yeah, this is pretty much what the maps are like. They're all just giant ramps. And every time people get sent back to the lobby, they explode. I I'm not really sure what that's about. Welcome everybody to Roblox Studio. This is where all the magic happens. If anybody anywhere makes a game in Roblox, it happens right here in Roblox Studio, baby. There's Bandy down there. You can see his name. Look at him down there. He's the guy. He's my brother. He made this game. He's down there doing real work. Okay, so I already kind of have a map started. As you can see, this is my level. This is a very cool level. Right now, it's called Bowser's Basil, which is obviously, it's supposed to be like oh. Bowser's Castle. I was going for lava type field because he, he has a lot of grass. So I'm going with this red brick. It's default Roblox texture, so it looks pretty bad at the moment. But I I have an idea on how we can fix that and boom look at that magic there's a new texture on there i think personally it looks better fits the cartoony theme a little bit more what i really wanted to do for this map was to incorporate lava in some way i'm not entirely sure how i'm gonna do that yet maybe we can make some kill blocks or some parts that ragdoll you. But I definitely wanted to add, like, some sort of tower or something. So, like, when you're sliding down, like, through this part, there's, like, a bunch of, like, towers passing by really fast. I think that'd be cool. I'm not sure what these towers are connected to. I don't think they're, uh, probably nothing. Okay, I placed some towers. Some could say I, I went a little overboard with how many there are. But think about how cool it'll be when you're sliding past them. Whee! I think what I want to do is I want to make the columns start to get closer together towards the bottom of the ramp and kind of like serpentine in and out so people have to like dodge them as they go down the ramp. I think that's a cool idea. Also, I'm going to try to experiment with some lava. How can we get some lava looking good, dude? Let's change it to cracked lava. Man, that looks so bad. Roblox, what are you thinking with these new textures, dog? Yeah. This is poopy, dude. This is not what I was hoping for when I said I wanted lava. This was not it. Voila, more pillars. So right now, you're going down and... And the pillars are closing in. What are you going to do? Where are you going to go? You got to swerve out. And then there'll be something else going on down here. I haven't figured that out yet. Yeah, take that and put it there. Jump over that. Try getting around that. Okay, I am having a little bit too much fun with this. So this is the first ramp part. This is where we were before. I added way more pillars. Why? Because pillars look cool when you go fast. Over here, I made this kind of shortcut thing. Kind of a shortcut, not really a shortcut. No. You can take this and then go over here and then try to pass people by like bouncing off the top of these pillars and then jump back into the race. I don't know if you'll actually be able to pull it off. Good luck. Looking good. Let's try this little thing right here. Whoa, it works. It works. That's sick. Oh, no. I also added this part. I thought this would be cool. If it got really skinny and scary to where people thought they were going to fall off, I thought that'd be fun. Okay, so now the skinny part turns into a ramp and then there's another ramp. So you go through here and then you have to kind of like hopscotch over these things and then you do that again. And then I think that's gonna be the end of the map. Is it possible? Maybe I can just jump it. Yeah, I think it's definitely safer to jump that. Maybe I should just make a giant gap. Make a giant gap in the freaking floor. You can make that. You can make that. Okay, this is the part. I don't know if it works. Oh. Everybody calm down. It's probably not that bad. See? You can do it. Oh, God. 
Oh my god. See? You can do it. It's possible. And I think that's it. I think I'm gonna make the, the map end, like, right over here. And we have ourselves a map. I've made it so they slide right into this weird box at the end of the race. And then they can just hang out there until they get bored or until everyone else finishes or something. She is beautiful. And she's as ready as she'll ever be. Now it's time to test the map for real this time in the game with these 36 live guinea pigs. Will they like it? Will they hate it? Will I destroy my brother's reputation? We find all that out and more now. It should be working. Kowser's Basil, there it is. Go, 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 go. Get out of my way, you goons. You, how could you? Look at, <laughs> Look at everybody hitting the <laughs> guys, you gotta go around the pillars. Come on, guys. You know this. You know how this works. <laughs> Holy crap. Oh, this is great. I am the greatest game designer. Ooh, the skinny, the tight rope. Look at this guy. I'm about to pass him. Get out of my way. You don't know how to play this map. Oh, I don't know how that happened. The checkpoint was like above the ground. <laughs> that was a mistake. Oh, no. I'm still alive. I can still do it. <laughs> but it's okay. I think I, I'm, I'm still okay. Oh, nope. Man, that's really... That, that sucks. This map sucks. Who made this? Has anybody made it to the edge yet? Oh, my. <laughs> oh no. I made it too hard. Guys, I made it too hard. Come on. Yes. Oh, my God. We're hitting max speeds. Yes. Lift off. Oh, little b-hop. Okay, that checkpoint still works. It's just floating above the ground. No! <laughs> Why did I make it like that? Once I master my own map, you guys will be in a world of pain. Oh, oh. Cheater, they're cheating. They're cheating. How did they get out there? <laughs> Sketch, you're bad. Don't be disrespecting me. I put a lot of effort into this map. Look at how many pillars I put. We're really gonna do it this time. Oh, cleared the pillars like an expert. Oh, oh, come on. Come on. Come on. No, no, I will not accept defeat. No! Ugh. Nah, you can't do that. <sighs> Bro, this game, I'm disliking this game right now. And like I said in the beginning of the video, he also made another game. It's called Easy Dev. It's kind of like a dev tycoon thing. I wanted to at least show you guys what he did with this because it's really cool. So you go to your PC, create a dev account, and then you ping the server. Every time you ping the server, you get this little blue electricity bolt. It travels through the wire into the server, and then you get money. But sometimes, you know, there's bugs that are preventing you from making money. Clear the bugs, and also watch out for the zaps because... Because if the zaps touch you, then you take damage. Ow, that hurt a lot. After you make enough money sending the pings to the server by clicking this thing right here, then you open Roblox Studio, you create a game, call it whatever you want, and then you upgrade your game, and then you'll have, like, active players and stuff. You'll make money from it. It's really cool. I hope you guys thought this video was interesting at the very least. If you want to check these games out, of course, like I said, in the description, go play them. Make my brother rich, or you're dead to me.